So let's connect our Zamp MySQL to Python. First of all, start your MySQL server, and it is running now. Let's check what we have in our MySQL server. Going on. Okay, we also need to start Apache to browse it through browser. If you just want to connect, you can connect using MySQL. So now let's check what we have in the database. Why am I not able to open this? Okay, so our database is open now, not database page in my admin. So we have these databases. There is a test and underscore db here so let's connect to this test underscore db database all right so let's go to our python file first of all okay first of all we need to install a package called python mysql connector all right so first of all what you need to do is you need to install that pip install python mysql connector all right uh, it is, uh, if you also get this message, pip install is, pip is not recognized. What you can do is, pip is not in your path. You can, if Python is in your path, you can go and do this: install Python MySQL connector. And I think this is not the name. It's MySQL connector Python or something like that. Yeah. So the name is MySQL connector Python, and this is installed. As you can see, successfully installed. Now let's get back to our Python code. So what you do is you import mysql dot connector, and then you just establish a connection first. So that is mysql dot connector dot connect, and then you add the details. What is your host? The host is localhost. If it is a remote server, you can add the IP of the remote server here, and then you have user. The user is root add your username here and the password by default there is no password set and that is what i have done i have not set any password to our uh, database and the database that we will be connecting to is test underscore db that is as you can see we will be connecting to this database that has this files table all right so yeah we will connect to this our connection will hold our connection variable hold will hold the connection to this database that is test underscore db Okay, so let's check if it is working or not. If connection dot is connected, we print, what do we print? Connected successfully. Else, what do we print? Let's say we print fail to connect. All right, and you can perform any DB operations here. I'll have a link to performing DB operations to tutorial on performing DB operations here. And once you have you have done performing operations like create, delete, read, or update, what you do is you need to close the connection so that you don't get an error like too many connections and so on later on. So what you're doing is you are just connecting to a database with these credentials with this host user password and detail and database name and if it is connected successfully i'm just printing connected successfully else i'm printing fail to connect now if it is connected what you can do is you can perform database operations here all right so you can like do whatever you want with the tables here and then once you are done you need to close the connection all right so let's check if this is working or not so i run this in pycharm the shortcut is shift f10 and as you can see i'm connected successfully if you have any questions let me know in the comments